So how good are you at adapting? How good are you at making changes to your life when you need to? Do you let other people decide mm -hmm. for you? Another thing my mom said, she said, the only opinion worth anything is your own. Because it comes from the truth inside of you. But what's my truth? Anxiety and stress. What's my truth? Abu Sa'd, the 14th century Sufi poet in the Persian Empire, wrote, Take one step away from yourself, and lo, behold the path. We're in the way of ourselves. That's what the Sufi poet is telling us. Abu Sa'id knew about human nature. We get in the way. So usually, we're 100% emotionally involved in a situation that involves a change. All the emotions, all the energy, every single bit of energy goes into that. I say, use the 10% solution. This is my 10% solution. Stand back 10% from the situation that involves the change. Don't get on top of it. We lose objectivity. We lose perspective. We lose the uh, opportunity to see the benefits and the, uh, the, uh, the drawbacks of the situation if we're simply laying on top of it. With distance, with distance, we can see that life is full of changes and surprises and curves. Understanding that life will always be in flux is a really healthy and positive way to practice self-reflection. Because instead of fighting the change and duking it out with it, we're going to integrate it into ourselves. And as a result, we're going to be able to reframe those old categories up here. Because change energizes us. 